the boo boo. So today, me and my dad are gonna be reacting to the top ten funniest moments in boxing. Hmm. Hmm. There is a video we'll link down below. Also, if you have any rest requests, let me know in the comments down below. And let's jump into the video. <laughs> I broke my back. What do you mean by that? You my broke back it? is broken. What, what, a, a vertebrae or, or well, what portion? Spinal. Okay. Max? You know a lot about boxing. But not as much as I think I know. This That's is Lisa Bella's favorite line, folks. No, no, no. You, you know a lot about boxing. You're good for the sport. But before you're so pedantic, take a deep breath. There are a lot of people that have been around the sport for a long, long time. Blah, blah, blah. What are you mad about? Max. Max. Pernell Whitaker? I know Pernell Whitaker. Pernell Whitaker is a friend of mine. And I'm no Pernell Whitaker? <laughs> no. Even Pernell Whitaker is sick of you talking about Pernell Whitaker. <laughs> is this what you're mad about? I'm talking about Pernell Whitaker? Max, take a deep breath. Let your partner speak occasionally. He's got an opinion, too. And apparently you do, too. Budamala <laughs> <laughs> acting as a consultant here this evening. I... I you having fun with him? Absolutely. How could you not have fun with Max? Well, we might have, we might have to bring you back here later on in the summer to see what else you might have to say again. And Max, that time I promise I'll be madder at you. Right. I don't know what you're mad about still. All right, here comes. What message did you just send? I'm the student heavyweight champion of Who's next? Well, let's talk about who's <laughs> next. The who only who who is who is who who Klitschko and you is in a sanctioning body. Tomorrow. I'm done. Ready tomorrow. The rest of the world wants to see you and Vladimir sort it out. I'm to see who the heavyweight champion of the world is. Oh, dude. That's um, I'm the best dude. heavyweight champion of the world. I'm WWE PC with me. I'm undefeated champion. Undisputed champion. I want one next. Okay. Vladimir beat you <laughs> the <laughs> first time, but you did knock him down three times. What do you have to say about a rematch with Vladimir Klitschko? We knocked him out. We knocked him out. Well, 21st place. Will you fight Vladimir Klitschko next if you can? All of them, they're going down. They're going down. Congratulations, Sam. Thank you. Let me talk about you, bro. Thank you. Jim. I didn't understand the answer. I'm not sure what he said about whether he would fight Vladimir Klitschko next. <laughs> Alright, alright, guys, we're waiting for Bernard Hopkins to officially be declared the winner, but in the meantime, I don't know whether we need that official conclusion to this fight. Bernard! And the winner is... And the winner is Bernard will make no difference. Bernard! Bernard, aren't you embarrassed by this? A great fighter having to fight a mandatory that's by the rules. I have to fight because they would do like Roy Jones didn't want him to do before he fought John Ruiz. No, don't tell me, fight. don't tell me about John. If anybody I didn't fight, else. If I didn't fight Larry, stop being ignorant. If I didn't fight and defend my mandatory with the WBC, is they would strip me. And I don't care what you say or anybody else say, this is my life, it's my prerogative. You do your job, I do mine. You think anybody wants to see this kind of fight again? Well, they, 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 it, don't, it don't matter if they want to see it again. It's the, it's the. Well, how do you get the, paid if nobody wants to see it? Well, I'll tell you what. I'm not leaving out here without a check tonight. Right. So let me tell you something. Yeah, yeah. Well, I, I, I mean, I don't know what kind of degree you got, but I got paid tonight. But I can assure you it won't happen again. Well, I tell you what, Larry. Unless you got powers other than being a commentator, then that's a part of the business and part of the problem. Hey. So since you exposed that to you to the world, let's move on to other issues. I want to fight the junior middleweight champions, the so-called the best. Hold up, hold up. Is, isn't it so, embarrassing for the middleweight champion in the world to be calling out junior middleweight champions? Well, junior middleweights is only five or six pounds away from middleweight. I mean, junior middleweights always been middleweights. Come Come on now, Larry. 15 years ago, they didn't have junior weight classes in boxing. It was welterweight, middleweight. Come on, right. Isn't it embarrassing when other fighters call each other out in different weight classes? So why is this so different? Because it's Bernard Hopkins? Yeah. Are you part of the system or are you, or are you with the system? Winky Wright, Winky Wright has stated he wants to call you. Do you want to fight Winky Wright? Well, is Winky Wright paying me or who's buying the fight? It depends on what the licensing fee is. It depends on what my share is. I don't fight just to be fighting. I did enough of that on Philadelphia streets in Philadelphia for free. So yes, I will fight anybody, but the fight is no problem. You gotta make the fight, the dollars gotta make sense, and we can move on and you can see better fights. Larry, I don't have an attitude, I just wanna get paid for my labor like any other working class citizen in America. Well, it looks like tonight you got paid for doing not much. Well, let me tell Jim, you something, Larry, you Ooh! get paid every 
day when the TV's not doing much. Wow. <laughs> Dude, we have to, but like, like I said right now, I'm going home and enjoy this. My birthday was Monday. Now I'm finally going home and enjoy it with some Burger King. Here I go, baby! Burger King! Burger King! Here I go! It's Dr. Bob Bear, gonna be my man. Now I can't kiss my ass! Oh. <laughs> The angry man issue a few angry challenges Happy at the end of that area. Burger King. Back to you at ringside. Daddy! Oh my roll day! I broke my back. What do you mean by that? Your back is broken. <laughs> a, a vertebrae or, or yeah. a portion? No. Yo, yo, he couldn't even stand up right now if he broke his back, man. Any regrets about anything that went on in the pre-fights and all the news conferences? Fake. Negative. I'm good. I beat Polly. I left with his belt and his girl. Adrian, congratulations on winning the title. Polly, come on. Of course you don't. Hey, I'm just saying, you lost. I know, I know, I lost. Yes, but don't. like I need to give that round to Randy Newman. Randy Newman is called Stone. One more outburst like that, you're out of here. We're going to do nothing for you. Nothing at all. We ain't going to do nothing for you. He's funny on the guy. It's a proven fast. All right? Go out and fight the fight. It's a proven fact. He's, he's ordering Stone out of the corner. Harold Bottom, an our in-house historian, is saying that this is unprecedented in his view. He does not remember a trainer ever being thrown out of a corner. I'll sue you for every fucking thing you got. You. Chris, what a class act. Corman Stone. Alex! Alex! You take over! I'm not going to say that. 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 i Banished from Ruiz's Definitely corner. This is the worst referee I've ever seen in boxing. He has to take it a point away. He hit Johnny in the back of the head, knocked him down. He's the worst referee. Something wrong here. I don't know what it is, but there's something definitely wrong. Yeah. I never said nothing to that guy. <laughs> That's why we're merging giggling. Well, we needed some comic relief. <laughs> I think there was an altercation out uh, in the parking lot. There's the cops and the reporters. And he's saying that Larry Holmes attacked him. And look at this, Charles. Oh! Larry Holmes with the swan dive off the top rope. Looks like something oh. out of the WWF. And he's attacking Trevor Burbick right here. The whole situation finally came to a head when Troy so approached Liston at the Desert Inn in Las Vegas. Shoot, Sam, what are you talking about? Shooting craps and losing. Liston was in no mood to be harangued by the mouth from the south. Drawing a gun, he shot him? frightening his young tormentor into a hasty retreat. The gun was filled with blanks. You know, David scares the hell out of me. Big, strong, athletic guy. 
That's for crazy. And look at pedigree. I mean, just a good, strong box. He scared the hell out of me. But he bought the fucking best out of me. Yeah. Can you say fucking Not one? really, but don't worry. I would love to fight Tyson Fury over here, or in Vegas, or anywhere that big pussy wants to fight. Finally. In your dressing room before the fight, I think you had a bit of Lionel Richie. Easy like Sunday morning. Like what, Sunday what's going to be the soundtrack for Saturday night for Tony Thompson? Hey man, I'm going to go home and break my wife's hip. I ain't had sex with her in a while. <laughs> She's going to feel the pain. No. And the pressure. Oh, no. it's going to be no, some pleasure. She might be crippled in the morning. So oh, um, if man. anybody out there want to donate a wheelchair to the save the Miss Thompson, yeah. all right, she'll Fine. be. Listen, well done, congratulations, enjoy your sleep. Yo, that's the, Lord, uh, that's the funniest one. Yo, Lord! That's disrespectful, though, man. He said, what? He gonna, he gonna break her hips. Anyway, man. Well, make sure y'all subscribe. Yeah, this dude's out here off the hook. Wow, man. wow, 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 wow. That was with the video. Um, yeah. Peace out. Yes. <laughs> There's nothing else to say. <laughs>